If you're like most people, you've probably heard of HIV, but you might not know much about it. Let's start with what HIV is and how it can affect the body. HIV, which stands for Human Immunodeficiency Virus, is a virus that attacks the body's immune system. The immune system is responsible for organizing a complex response to fight viruses and bacteria that enter the body from the outside world. This response is essential for maintaining good health. When HIV gets into the body, it attacks the immune system and over time, it can severely weaken the body's ability to fight off disease and illness. HIV does this by targeting and entering a type of cell in the immune system known as the CD4 cell. HIV needs to take over the CD4 cell in order to make copies of itself. When the new HIV copies are released from the CD4 cell into the body, the CD4 cell is destroyed. The new viral copies then go on to infect more CD4 cells in the body to make even more copies of HIV. This is called viral replication. Without HIV treatment, over a few years, the number of CD4 cells in the body is depleted. This weakens the immune system's ability to fight disease and illness because CD4 cells play an important role in directing our body's immune system response. When the immune system has been badly damaged by HIV, it leaves the body vulnerable to life-threatening infections and cancers. This is known as AIDS, or Acquired Immunodeficiency Syndrome. Thanks to effective HIV treatment, most people with HIV in Canada never get AIDS. Now let's look at how HIV is transmitted and how it can be prevented. HIV is transmitted from person to person. In Canada, HIV is most often transmitted when people have vaginal or anal sex without using any HIV prevention method and when people share equipment to inject drugs. HIV can also be passed during pregnancy and childbirth, but this is rare in Canada. There are many effective ways to prevent HIV, using condoms for sex, new equipment to inject drugs, and taking HIV prevention medications like pre-exposure prophylaxis, PrEP, and post-exposure prophylaxis, PEP, are all highly effective ways to prevent HIV. Another highly effective way to prevent passing HIV is for people living with HIV to be on successful treatment. Successful HIV treatment prevents the virus from passing to sex partners and can also prevent it from passing to a baby during pregnancy or delivery. Successful treatment can also lower the chance of passing HIV when people share equipment to inject drugs, but we don't know by how much. So how do people know if they have HIV? The only way for someone to know if they have HIV is to get tested. People can have HIV and not know it. Some people have flu-like symptoms when they first get HIV, such as a fever, a sore throat, or swollen glands, but many people have no symptoms at all. The only way to know for sure is to get tested. Now let's look at HIV treatment. While there is no cure for HIV, with proper treatment and care, people with HIV can live long and healthy lives and avoid passing it on to others. In fact, a person living with HIV who is on successful treatment cannot pass it on to their sex partners. Today's treatments are so effective that when used as prescribed, they can reduce the amount of HIV in the body to levels that aren't detectable by current tests. This is known as having an undetectable viral load. Being undetectable does not mean that HIV is no longer in the body. It's still there, but at greatly reduced levels. If treatment is stopped, the amount of virus in the body will start to increase and HIV will become detectable again. This can also happen if someone is not taking their treatment as prescribed. We have learned that there are huge benefits to starting HIV treatment as soon as possible, before the virus has had a chance to do much damage to the immune system. The earlier someone is diagnosed with HIV after infection and the earlier they start treatment, the better it is for their health. With the highly effective and easy to take treatments now available, many people can limit the long-term effects of HIV infection on their body by starting treatment early. 
However, some people don't get diagnosed until later in their infection after their immune system has been damaged by HIV. But even in these cases, it is possible for the immune system to recover some of its function if a person starts treatment as soon as possible and takes treatment as prescribed. HIV treatment is a lifesaver. There are now many HIV medications available that are very effective and have few or no side effects. Starting and staying on treatment is the best thing that a person living with HIV can do for their health. To find HIV testing, prevention, and treatment services near you, visit HIV411.ca.